Not only is what is coming better, we're going to receive something that will make us happy. Isn't, isn't every creature living to attain a level of, of happiness, right? Trees, they'll lean towards the sun. Everyone is living and existing you know, for what would make it happy. And we shouldn't shy away from that. It's one of the reasons people love Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and have devotion is because it makes them happy. You know, yesterday, we, we just attended three Mu'adad in a row. We talked about the love of the Messenger, peace be upon him. But I wish that the topic came up. And if I had had a chance to talk again, I would have said it. People don't really understand how is it you love somebody you've never seen. It doesn't make any sense. So the concept and the idea is that people love the salawat first. The, the practice. Because saying these salawat, you may think like, I don't know, I'm going to try it, Right? But when you do, it's, it's almost like a spiritual honey enters inside you. Such a sakina and a cure for all of these terrible things that happen to people and these feelings that are inside one are just gone. Like I can't even explain how. Nothing changed in the world. The feeling is gone. So people first love the salawat because they experience it. You cannot just love somebody who is just an idea. You have to feel something first. If you can't see it, you got to feel it at least. So that's what we do have. We do have that feeling, right? And then there's like the other aspect of love the Prophet is purely mental. And we live now, you look around, there's no drugs, there's no alcohol, there's no zina. You don't realize how massive these three things are. There's no interest debt because credit cards. I want to get something, I'll pay for it later, right? It's, a, it's one of the te most tempting ideas. If there was interest, I would have started 50 businesses by now, right? I can't, because there's interest. Gambling, these people are almost like suicidal, right? When they mess up. So all these things that are actually like, they ruin people's lives. They mentally realize, thank God that we have this religion, because otherwise I wouldn't be able to, 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 to apply that to myself or others. So all these is how the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam by the law that Allah brought through him, saved us from all these problems. So that's mental. Then the salawat, that's a feeling. So people are always trying to be happy. And, and those salawat, that's why people love the messenger. First, they love the salawat. Then, after some time, they start to attribute that to the Prophet himself. That they start to connect it to the Prophet. Just like in, in Islam, people love the acts of worship first. Then they love Allah after that. Because you think of the acts of worship, they give us something to do. Masajid, Umrah. You go to Hajj, Ramadan, every night. It's like all of a sudden, like, I got friends. I know people. There's always something to do. So you love the acts of worship first. And then the one whom you worship, that is, is, comes later. Right? So there's always got to be this connection. So here, when we say this, people love Allah because Allah makes them happy. Like, that's a real simple answer to it. Right? If someone asks me, why do you do, well, what's going on, why do you do this? It makes me happy, what can I tell you, right? I had issues, I said, let me give this a shot, my issues went away. I wanted things, I said, let me go to this source, I got those things. It's very selfish in the beginning, but that's okay, because that's the actual reality of life. People care about themselves first, right? And then after that, you, you start looking at, who gave me all this? Now, you reach a point that, Okay, from here on, I want to live as a grateful servant. Like, I want to be grateful for this. I want to show gratitude for this. And that's how you live. So this is the importance of this ayah. Right? Allah Ta'ala is going to give you so that you become happy.